<laughs> it's like, look, look, at, look at this guy. Oh, dear. And on the left are Udad. Oh, dear. Uh, plural, sorry. You see a little baby <laughs> laying down? They're so adorable. Oh. They call them Barbary sheep, but they're actually really closely related to mountain goats. I don't know. Oh, look at that. Those are Nilgai over in the distance. It's the main food for tigers. Oh. Uh, tigers? First, we're at the Americas. This is both North and South America. You see the buffaloes? Oh man, what is this Oh my god, Chris. Don't check it. We're from the right here, we have Roosevelt Elk. We're waiting. They're eating for Teddy Roosevelt, the father of conservation. We have a lot of national parks because of Teddy Roosevelt, like Yellowstone. Yeah, they could. No, this is scary, man. Are they tranquilizing dogs here somewhere? Yeah, they are still losing some of that. This is scary. They're right there. Over on the left, in the closer, we have fallow deer. Oh, those, those are cute. inspired Bambi. They keep their spots on oh, them all through adulthood. The farther ground, we have the llamas. They're from South America. And you can't miss the big old bison coming up on the left. If you look at some of the smaller Whoa, ones, they're actually that. the babies from last year. We're still waiting for our babies for this year. Some of the buffalo are pregnant, so they'll be popping any time now. When the babies are born, they're actually orange. It's like a VR. You see them walk right across the It's street. actually to protect them from the sun so they do not get sunburned. So all their good fur grows in. And even at the end of the season, sometimes you'll see that some of the babies are still losing some of that orange fur. So they're like half brown, half orange. It's Sounds really pretty. Cool to see. Coming up on the right is our closer look at the Roosevelt elk. If you notice, there is one white one. Some lions. She's not albino, she's actually leucistic. Kevin's melanin is only in her eye, so her eyes blue instead of red. We have a few leucistic animals here on the safari. And you see the males actually have some small antlers right now, because they shed their antlers every year. So this is what they have in the spring, but come fall, they're going to oh, That's be pretty eating. dope. Chris is uh, cat calling. Chris is cat calling all these animals. Like the New Yorker that he is, is cat calling. Alligators. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Coming up on the right are rheas. They are closely related to the ostriches, but they are a lot smaller. The males are the ones with the black on their neck. Females do not have that. They have three toes instead of two. Yo, that's just have. like the one that we, that we saw with Coachella, no? Right? They lay about 20 eggs at a time, and the males are the ones that incubate them. Oh, yeah? Or where you sell them right. Oh, man, I thought one They are flightless right. birds. They <laughs> run really fast, though. This is a, so this was a bad idea. It was a bad idea. Other females eggs. But I thought well. you checked the weather though. Good job, Chris. Good job. Oh yeah, so 